Our thoughts are superpower number one. I like to call this thought intelligence. TQ for short. <laughs> thought intelligence. When we understand the power of our thoughts and how to think, oh, that superpower just opens up for us. The thought cycle is a biological process that scientists and medical professionals are proving this is what happens when we think. The thought cycle is a four quadrant cycle. When we think, that triggers emotion. And then our emotion creates action within us. Actions create our result. And the result recreates new thoughts. This cycle always goes clockwise. You can't go backwards. You can't go from a thought to a result. Your thoughts will always go to an emotion and then to an action and then to a result and then the cycle continues that way. So really, if you look at this, you can, you can kind of go backwards and, and bring clarity to maybe some, some struggles you've had. So when you say, I am angry, it's taking ownership of that anger. And if that's where your thought is going to be, well, then what's the emotion that comes out of that? I mean, there's nothing but more heated type of emotions. In all reality, though, friends, you're not anger. You're not angry. You're not the little red character on the movie Inside Out whose top blows off when he gets so frustrated and angry. That's not who we are. We are not anger. We might feel angry. It's okay to be angry. Well, this is where the ownership really comes in, right? Let's go back. Let's go back in this thought cycle. My thought is someone took what was mine without permission. It's creating this emotion of anger in me, and that's why I feel angry. What am I going to do about it? Well, hopefully not punch a wall or anything drastic. Hopefully I can take that deep breath, have some productivity going forward with it, right? You know, when, when we're angry, we're probably in more of a mm, negative red light type of cycle. You can't avoid that. Okay, we can't always be in the green light. We can't always be in the positive side of things. Things are going to happen that are going to give a, get, get us frustrated. They're going to make us angry. They're going to make us sad. They're going to make us depressed. You know, all of those emotions, they're not, they're not positive and green light. They're more of the red light type of category. It's about choosing our words and our thoughts wisely so that we can handle the red cycle.